Okay guys, welcome back to Mega Man X3. I just realized I didn't actually uh, say that what boss I was going to do in the next one. That's because I hadn't decided yet. And now I think I'm going to go after him now because we can get both a sub tank and a heart tank from him. Now we don't have his weakness, but it's very useful that we do go after him right now. He's actually pretty cool. He, he's a lot like Sigma, name being uh, Neon Tiger. Like Sigma's name in the last one being uh, like the Neon Sigma. It was it was interesting. He's got even he even has like the claws like Sigma did. So he's very similar to Sigma was. That doesn't make any sense. He was similar. He's similar to what Sigma was. I'd also like to mention, since I haven't mentioned yet, that all these episodes will be pre-recorded. It's gonna be weird this coming out in like the what third episode now. This has gotta be the third, right? Might no, this is the one, two, three, four. Yeah, this is the fourth. <laughs> well, now you know, this video is all these videos are pre-recorded, so you can comment and say things, but I really won't get any suggestions if you have them. Oh god damn it, get up there. You're supposed to use these guys to help you out, but since I have the leg upgrade, I really don't need them that much. What else should I say? I have I had something else I was gonna say. I can't remember what it was. Oh, right, right. I, know, I remember, but we're not there yet. When we get to a certain... In the last... I'm not even sure if I've showed them yet. Oh, well, either way, we can save those for later, because I forgot that we had the drill piece, and the drill is one of the most important things you can get in this game, because it opens up a lot of pathways, like the uh, that metal blade thing was in the last one. Enter this capsule X take this X Buster upgrade. Oh, nice, yes, we can get the upgrade. You know what, we could do, like, a, go a comeback. Oh, wait. Never mind, no, we can't. <laughs> There's nothing we can do yet. The upgrade will increase the strength of your charged shots. You will be able to shoot two charged shots at once. If timed correctly, you can overlap the shots to create a single cross-charged shot. The upgrade will also allow you to charge any special weapon. I can't remember what we had in a... No, no, we had a double shot, right? He shot one, and then he shot another. Well, in this one, it's kind of similar. However, they added one more little upgrade to it. So, take a look. That. You can do that. So, you can still have the two individual charged shots, like that and that. But they added that fact that they can overlap and create that huge shot. Ow. Okay, I'm not sure if I'll have to face Bite now. Oh wait, no, no, this is, uh, this boss is in here no matter what, so. Ow! Oh god. This guy's annoying. He's easy to beat, but he really makes me- Oh wow, I got him! I mean, I, I got him. That was totally intentional. I definitely meant to do that. I'm just... Yeah, I, I didn't think I'd actually get him there. I completely forgot. There was no part of my mind that thought that I would have got him there. I didn't even think he was that low health. Wow, okay, these things. This is what I wanted to talk about. These things... You notice how we saw each Mega Man X had ride armor. X1 and X2 had their own individual ride armor. Well, in this game, there's four different ride armors. And two of them are from the previous games. And then they added two more. And you can summon them by using this. But I haven't collected any of the ride armor yet. You have to save one, like, which is being held. Not really captured, but it's it's being held somewhere. So you have to rescue it, I guess. I guess being... I guess rescue it, because, you know... It's 
being held up by something. And then you can you can activate them here. So they're really useful. And there those things are there's at least one in every stage. Oh Jesus Christ. Okay, this might be bite, but then again, maybe not. Let's see. Nope, no bite. And it's good that there isn't him either, because this guy, the Neon Tiger, I believe is his weakness, so it'd be good to have him, or have his weakness, because then it'd be way easier to take him out. Okay, careful, there's some spikes there, but they don't actually kill you. These little things create these little spikes on the floor, so... They don't actually kill you, but they do do a decent amount of damage, so... I want to avoid those spikes. Yeah... Oh, wait, 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 wait. Hey, you, get back here! You bastard. You! Floaty thingy, come back! Whatever, I don't need you. Ooh, that was close. Hard tank. So we got everything we could on this stage. That's awesome. Okay, I don't expect to beat him. Unless we do this. Go for it. I'm gonna try it out. And I know we don't have his weakness either, so... In fact, I can't even remember what his weakness is. Oh god. Oh nice, I got him with that. Ow! Oh nice, I got him with that. Ah! Damn, he's harder than I remember. Why does he keep doing this attack? Oh, that would have killed me. Got him! He did a lot of wall jumps on that last little bit. It's a good thing he was in the middle of the stage, otherwise he just would have been an, an ordinary wall jump. His AI is interesting, how he jumps onto the wall like that. And depending where he, on it, where he is on the stage, he'll jump differently onto the wall. Like, he has a certain trajectory. That's interesting how he does that. He was in the middle of the stage, he jumped right, and then jumped back, and ended up on the very, like, bottom of the wall, and ended up right there. He did a lot of different, like, wall jumps. You know how you watch, like, when you're watching a DVD, and it's, and it's like, you shut it off, and that little DVD symbol is going above, like, around the screen, it's got a different trajectory each time, and you're waiting for it to hit the corner? It's similar to that. He had a very interesting trajectory. Anyway, that's the end of the episode, so I hope you liked the episode. Thanks for watching. Press that like button. I said that wrong. If you liked the episode, press the like button. Comment. Tell me what you like about the series so far. I'll read them when I can, but I will be on vacation for a while, so I won't, I won't get back to this for a while. I won't be able to see anything for two weeks until while these are up. And if you like the channel, uh, press that subscribe button, because I plan to do a lot more. Anyway, I'd like to go into a little bit more detail. Sometime on the... I can't remember. Sometime in July. Late 20s. I'll be going on vacation for two weeks. So I won't be back. But that's why I wanted to do Mega Man X. I believe I'll be able to get it out every other day. Including the weekends. <laughs> I'm saying that like like it's, it's a surprise. But yeah, I'll try to have a, a video out every other day. I'm not sure how long it'll last. I'm not sure how many episodes it will be. So we'll see. Either way, 
again, that's it for this episode. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next one. See you guys next time.